Eating is one of the highlights of a dog's day and feeding a dog is often one of the highlights of an owner's day as well. There's something um, about the whole process of getting food, giving to the dog, the dog looking at you with big eyes and the enthusiasm, the enjoyment. It's a really social occasion. So equally, if your dog doesn't want to eat, that's a bit of a downer. It's a downer for you because you're not having the same full interaction with your dog and it's a worry as well because does it mean there's something seriously wrong with your pet? And indeed, lack of appetite is one of the key signs that there is something wrong with your pet. So if your dog doesn't eat, should you worry? Should you rush to the vet or what should you do? Well, I think the first thing is to look at the different possible reasons why a dog might stop eating. And the first one is a change in routine. So if you, let's say, have got visitors in your house or if you're in a new place or um, if um, the dog maybe hasn't gone for a walk that morning, there's different reasons where if the routine has changed, a dog will just not want to eat for no particular reason. Just, they just feel a little bit stressed, I suppose. So that's, stress is perhaps one of the first reasons why a dog might just miss some food. Um, another reason would be if there was a change in diet. Dogs are used to eating what they're used to eating. And if you give them something new, it's quite common for them, for them not to want to eat it. Um, so that's, that's another reason. The third reason is a mild gastric upset. Um, dogs are very... Um, uh, they eat all sorts of things, and because they eat all sorts of things, they're sometimes not very clever about what they eat, and they sometimes eat stuff which irritates their stomach. They might be out on a walk, they might eat some half-rotten leaves, or they might eat a, 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 some sort of carcass or something. Goodness only knows what they eat, and um, if, if they eat something that um, irritates their stomach, and that will often cause them to feel a bit nauseous and and just not like eat it, not like eating anymore. Even if they're not actually physically sick, they may just be upset enough to not want to eat. So that's a really common cause of a dog not eating. Um, so we've got stress, we've got mild gastroenteritis. The third thing though is illness, and there's a whole bunch of different illnesses that can cause a dog to stop eating. Um, so that's the complicated reason. So when should you worry? Well, I think missing one meal is no big deal. If a dog always has breakfast and one day doesn't have breakfast, then I wouldn't really worry about it at all. I'd be watching the dog for other signs of illness, but I wouldn't be fussing about going to the vet. If, however, a dog misses two meals, if they don't eat their breakfast and they don't eat their dinner, um, that is a sign that there's something going on that oughtn't to be going on. And so certainly um, I will be getting ready to go to the vet so that when you offer the breakfast the next morning, if they still haven't eaten, um, then you definitely need to take them to the vet. Um, and that's presuming they're bright and well themselves, by the way. If a dog doesn't eat one morning and at the same time is completely flat and dull and doesn't want to get out of the bed, or if they've got other signs of illness, you know, like, I, I don't know, um, uh, if, if the, the gums look pale or, you know, if you notice anything else about them that's not right as well as not eating, well then, of course, you go to the vet on the first day. But for a dog that is perfectly normal but just not eating, it's quite acceptable to wait for 24 hours. Um, and really, that's about it. Um, not eating is something which should never be ignored, um, but you shouldn't panic about it.